Right, so today we've got this one to sandblast. We're going from that line there down to a nice place where it finishes. I'll get a couple of shots in a minute, but I'm just going to let this compressor warm up.
Is there now that way? I don't want to be on. <laughs> it's seen the video before. Right, that's that's half of it. That's what we've got done today. Um, plan now is he's going to paint. Well, he's going to get some primer on this side. So then tomorrow, when I get here, I've just broke, I broke away so that this bit here, they can paint that. And then if I do need to touch that up in the morning, it's fine. But it should be all right. And then we've got that rest of that to do. That's tomorrow's job. How far back did I get? I've just got my mask on because it's a bit dusty in here while it's blowing my off. Could be alright for tomorrow. Right, what's going to be 12 hours for me is going to be. Now, right, let's see if he's painted that. Left this, like I said. So that's done alright from yesterday. It has been humid last night. Right, and this has got a coat of. So this has got a coat of primer on it now. I think it's zinc primer, I'm not sure. I can't tell you. I don't know, to be fair. I've heard them talk about it before, but luckily, we've got some paint on and this has done a little spout. Good job we got a bit of primer on it because now that'll dry off and it'll not tinge. I think it's it's these lighting, these lights make it flicker and it puts like a shadow onto it, on, on this. I can't, I don't know, there's a setting on my camera that I can change that but I don't know how to do it. I've seen it before but, oh well, it is what it is. The only thing is, it should have left, should have left about this much before painting. Because now I'm going to hit this and it's going to... Um, well, it's mainly this here. When I hit this, it's going to shoot up here. Unless I can get a better angle. Um, mainly this and all. When I hit back of that, it's going to splash up. I should have really done that bit before yesterday, but... We can fly over that bit. We can duck back side of this, no problem. And then uh, down there today. So, let's make a start. and it's perfect timing for it to be sandblasted. You can see how it's just holding water just in the top layer, little pockets of water. If that were left any longer, it would start causing it to rust. I ran, out of, uh, I ran out of glass, so I had to use a bit of J-Blast and that's your difference between J-Blast and uh, glass it's, it's, hard, it's hard to show you but that's a slightly deeper profile than that but that's obviously still a profile that's good enough for paint both of them's good enough for paint it's just that that stuff's slightly heavier and it's, it's mainly for more rusty stuff than, than hotels Plus that stuff slightly dearer, that's why I don't like using it. I prefer to use glass. 
Got that for the job. They're going to get on it now and get some, well, we've got to blow it off. We're going to get uh, Tom round. He's going to blow it off. He'll blow all his boat off for him. Um, and customer's going to help Tom. I think he's helping him paint it, to be fair. So I think customer and Tom's going to end up doing this one today. Oh, the only thing I need to tell him about this, it started weeping a bit here, so I think it said some water behind it. So I've had that one, you can see with the airline, I was just blowing it to try and get some of that water out behind that. Cause just missing a little bit of weld and it's sucked on a bit of water but I'll let him know about that in a minute look at that and that's uh, obviously a painted bit from yesterday it's going to get another two coats of primer so this side will get a coat of primer on it today and that'll probably get another coat on it today then tomorrow they're going to probably put another two coats of primer on it and I think it's getting two or three coat, top coats on it I feel like to stick a thumbs up for us and we'll catch you on next time